Hello there, beautiful people. So I'm going to do my unboxing of the X-Pointer. I thought I was getting the X-Pointer Pro, but apparently not. So um, I have message quests because there might have been an issue with stock or maybe I got the wrong end of the stick. Um, I would have happily paid for it, but um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> um, we've just done our unboxing of the Quest Q30 Plus. Um, so yeah, either watch that one or yeah, I'll, I'll leave a link to it at the end of this um, at the end of this video. And yeah, fingers crossed you like it. Um, it's a very noob attempt at it. I mean, I went through it as a complete beginner, as a novice, and opened it all up, put it together, and um, we did a couple of tone tests at the end as well. So yeah, fingers crossed we got a nice little video there. I haven't seen it because obviously I'm still out recording. So <laughs> let's get on with it. So we've got an X pointer just here. Okay, so we've got our bag of gubbins. So we got ourselves, what are these? Aha! So we got ourselves a couple of pointer covers. They're really handy to stop it getting damaged. Um, yeah, no, really happy with those. And we got ourselves a quest, little, um, oh, tr treasure spots, should I say. Um, almost lanyard. So what you do is connect that one to your belt buckle, or not belt buckle, to your um, belt loop. This one to the um, pointer, and then if you drop it, it's going to come back up and you're not going to lose it. So that's quite handy. Um, it's very waterproof as well, this thing. So even if you drop it in a river, it's, it's going to, fingers crossed, float. But if you've got it connected to something like that, that's good. Uh, yeah, so a couple of ah, pointer covers. I'll keep one of those out for demonstration purposes. We got ourselves our bag of information. So, you know it's Quest when you get free stickers. Gotta love a free sticker. So we got our warranty in there, got our instruction booklet, and they always chuck in the catalog. So you can always see the newer models and what's on, what's happening. So we got ourselves our a little card um, suggesting that you download the free iOS and Android app. Um, and you can, yeah, like I said in the past video, uh, you can actually connect it and put your finds on there. So it'll tell you exactly where you found it. And I believe everyone else can sort of see. So I don't know whether if, if you're gonna find treasure and like a, a real treasure, you wanna put it on there, I'm not too sure. Maybe you can after it's been um, been through the system. And then I, I'm not sure. Uh, I'll have to have a little look. <laughs> uh, so on the back here, it says, join us and share finds to win prizes. So that's always nice. Yeah, way. Gonna throw it everywhere. So, sorry, I had a nap flow in my nose. Yeah, so there, there was always good. So we got our pointer. And like I said, I wanted the pro version really. I mean, I'm not gonna complain. It's it's a pointer and fingers crossed it's better than my Nocta pointer because that's been playing up, especially in um, highly mineralized soil. It's been a bit iffy, like literally you push it under the soil and it goes off and it's obviously it's not very helpful when you're trying to find something when you f actually find the item you can hear the difference but it yeah it's, it's not ideal so it comes in a really really good quality sheath here um so it's a little holster uh so it comes off on velcro and also a little button so you can pop that on your belt loop um yeah just pop that on your belt loop or connect your lanyard to this or actually on the q30 plus it comes with a couple of little holes on the side here. So you can use this on the, ah, try not to throw it everywhere. So you can connect it. Uh, so on the top of your um, metal detector, you've always got your pointer. So you literally just pop it in there. I got it in the wrong way, but yeah, lovely jubbly. Um, so on your Quest pointer, pop your pointer end, which is actually a lot tighter than I was imagining. Oh no, come back. It's a lot tighter than I was imagining, which is good because it's not going to come off. <laughs> so on the on here we've got a ruler. <clears throat> so if you're putting it in the hole, it goes up to three inches with half increments, which is quite nice. So you can see how deep the hole is. So if you go, I don't know, I found a sovereign. I uh, found a nice gold sovereign in the hole. It was okay, three and a half inches deep, and you got a good goodish scale there. Um, so you got two buttons on here and you've also got a torch which is quite nice so the main power button is the front one unfortunately th obviously this one has batteries and I don't have any so I can't do a little test run on that one but um, you'll see it in upcoming videos and you'll see whether I like it if I stop using it you know it's not very good <laughs> but I'm sure it's gonna be brilliant I mean I, I quest have been excellent I really have enjoyed quest um, I know it's slightly biased in me saying so because I've only really ever used quest but 
I haven't had any issues aside from this one breaking and they were very quick to go right send it in we'll sort it out <laughs> so we got the front button here so if we imagine it this way around so the pointer top is the top so the top button here is our power button to so push and hold that one bloop and it will come on and it will be ready to rock and the bottom button is your alarm button so I, I believe if you top push the top one multiple times it will go through the sensitivity and things like that and it will also probably do the torch um, and the bottom one seemed to be um, looking at the manual uh, seemed to be the alarm function uh, again please don't hold me directly to that but from what I can see that is the case I'd love to I wish I really bought some batteries but uh, again I thought this was the pro so <laughs> um, I assumed I didn't need them Ooh, spooky chicken sound effects so we got ourselves a couple of batteries in here um, I'm assuming this is a D battery because we have two little holes one bigger than the other um, yeah it's gonna be a D so pop it on there and this bit on top here pushes it down holds it in nice and tight screw that one back in and you're ready to rock yeah it is really nice and light it's got some good weight to the tip here uh, to the actual pointer um, the pointer shaft and the rest of it's really nice and light I imagine with a D battery it'll have a bit more um, not a quality feel to it because it does feel it feels lovely and strong it's lovely and bright so you're never gonna lose it if you drop that I know imagine in some grass maybe not in a massive cornfield you're probably not going to find anything in that so if you drop it in some relatively long grass you're going to go oh where's my oh there it is <laughs> so that's quite handy and obviously with the alarm function you'll hear it as well so it will help you find it a little bit easier so to end this i'm actually going to connect this to the q30 and um see if we can do a good show as to how the holster works i'm sure this is yeah yeah, it even has a picture of a pointer on it. Look. So, unless it comes with a very specific... No, no, it's not. It's all working. We're doing it. We're doing it! So I go through. There's a little popper on there to help hold it into place. If I can see it. There we go. And it's got a bit of Velcro as well. So that's lovely. So you pop that one in there. And then while well, you're metal detecting, bloop, 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 bloop. Perfect. Pop that one on. It can even stand up on its own, which is really nice. Whip that one out. Don't fall over. Don't know. <laughs> Just to prove me wrong. And there you go. You got your pointer. So you're ready to rock straight out of the box. Well, not out of the box, but yeah. So you just need your shovel on this side and you got it ready to rock. Perfect. Right, well thank you guys so so much. We hit 153 subscribers today, which is just amazing. Fingers crossed we can get some more. And yeah, thank you guys for all your love, for all your support, for all your messages. Absolutely love speaking to you guys. So thank you ever so much. If you have any questions, please give me a shout out. Uh, not a shout out, but give me a message and I'm more than happy to talk. Um, yeah, night or day. <laughs> I don't sleep a lot, I've got two kids. So yeah, lovely jubbly. Now I'm really hoping tomorrow to get out for two good, um, two good hunts. I'm going to come out with my daughter during the day, fingers crossed. Um, it's supposed to be a lovely day, so hopefully you can come out with my daughter during the day. We do another daddy-daughter day uh, hunting, and we'll do a big old hunt in the evening, hopefully. And we can get a couple of good videos. Fingers crossed we get some nice finds. Yeah. And yeah, keep your ears open for a nice giveaway when I hit 1,000 subscribers.